going to Mars. Welcome to SpaceX, people. Today, we have a crazy show. Uh, the British are here. The British came. Dun, dun, dun. They're already here. <laughs> uh, welcome, Sack. Nice to Thank have you here. You. Thanks for having me. Thanks for inviting me into this um, wild setup you have here. Yes. Also, Corel, which everybody has seen before, is here also. Everyone Arguably knows Corel. Corel. Everybody knows Corel. I've been here a day and I know Corel. Corel was my first guest ever. Really? Yeah, that's how we kind of met. Well, we kind of met a little bit before, but then we've become friends. Yeah. Uh, but he was the first ever SpaceX. I call this SpaceX people. Yeah, yeah. And this is just like a strange thing that has happened, kind of like what we started talking about. So let's start here, right? Um, you're fr from the UK, but are you from a particular city? or? Yeah, well, I'm, I was born just outside of Bristol. But um, no idea nobody that is. will know where yeah. it is. So I live in London at the minute. Okay. So um, okay. Yeah, I'm doing the YouTube thing in London, and everyone knows where that is. So. Yeah, yeah. I, I watched, I told you, I watched a bunch of your videos. So I would say, like, uh, go check him out. It's, it's insane stuff. It's really cool. Thank you. I, I really enjoyed, like, a lot of the pranks and a lot of the, the I, I really liked the paparazzi, the way you did the two-part. Yeah. And the way you were trying to get Lady Gaga. And it, it was, it was funny. Um, he's funny and it's really good. I think everybody should check this out. Thank you. So why are you here? Good question. Yeah. I'm a man on a mission. Okay. Just like I feel like you are. I feel like Corell is. We're, we're just men on a mission. Um, so I've come from the UK to try and track down Elon Musk and I've got one question for the man. And that's all I want from him. I want 23 seconds of his time to be accurate. I don't need any more than that. But what we're, we're landing here. Yes. In Brownsville. And then going over to Boca Chica, and we're just seeing what we can sort of turn over. We're making as much noise as possible. So before you came, yeah, did you investigate how hard that is to do? <laughs> no, but if you were to put like a probability on it, yeah, you know, yeah. the odds are stacked against us. But I'm a firm believer of just like turning okay, up. Okay, let's happen. start with this question, Zach. Okay, do you know if he's here? Well, we've we've spoke to a few locals who who believe that he's centering around the area. Um, apparently, he's at the SpaceX site quite frequently. Yes, that's true. But he also travels all over the world. He does, right? He so, does. do you know for a fact if he's here? I don't think he might. <laughs> okay, no, because I think we <laughs> could find out. This guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We could, that's why we could find out. Well, I'm hoping so. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Okay, that's one. Okay. Two is, uh, whole like corporate channels have moved here mm. to do what you're trying to do. Yeah, yeah. And they haven't been able to do it in like <laughs> years, right? Like there's a there's a thing called Space Channel mm. that moved from LA, moved their whole operation here, just because they thought they would get access because they're called Space Channel. Yeah. And they don't get access. But this Man. is this is the beauty. This is the beauty of, of uh, and that's the reason why mm -hmm. I'm excited to do it, because it's difficult to do. Very, very difficult. Yeah. So, you know, the odds are definitely against you, but I'm helping, you know, yeah. with the help of people like you guys. Yeah. And uh, I, th I feel like the Britishness, it definitely has an appeal to it. Appeal? Yeah. 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 You think that that will help? Yeah. Well, I'd, every place I've been in so far, I've been like, you know, where, where are you from? <laughs> I've not heard that accent yeah. here and ever. I, I'll be honest. I think the best chance that you have. Yeah is that you catch him at the work site and you yell at him and that maybe he'll yell back. Yeah, yeah. Right? That's kind of maybe the close. There's a very tight security. You know, he's got, like, real tight security all around the, the installation. So you can't, like, yeah. break in. No, no. It would be really bad. Um, for, for, for you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it would hurt. you got some good ideas, though. Yeah, have, we, have we definitely... Have you executed any? Are those still... In so, planning? yeah, we're, we're, we're still... They're in. They're in flow. Today, today's game day. Basically, today yeah. is today is the game of yeah, yeah. The, the game of day is the day of the game. The day of the game. <laughs> so, so yeah. what are the things that are going to make it a successful day? Yeah. So, I mean, for success for the video, yeah, we don't necessarily need Elon. That would be creme de la creme. The ice and all cake. It. That would be amazing. Um, and I'm hoping you guys can, you know perhaps help with getting closer to figuring out whether he's even here for right. starters. Right, but right. today we're we're gonna we're gonna go down to Boca Chica village. Right. And we're gonna cause a bit of noise and we're gonna check out the site. We're hoping to um 
you know, chat to employees, sort of speak to people who can get us, move us closer, closer, closer. Uh, we're trying to chat to his neighbours if there's any still left. I know yeah. the area maybe yeah, there's a couple might have been bought out. Um, but we're just we're, we're sort of reeling them in. We're reeling them in. So today yeah. is just about starting from back here, and we're going dun 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 closer, closer, closer. And then on the off chance, which you know the, these weird things tend to happen when you like put yourself in a scenario. Yeah, I mean it, it. Anything can happen. I'm telling you, like I've been in the mix now. Yeah. And crazy stuff happens to me now, right? <laughs> Which never used to. Yeah. We're, so Brownsville is one of the poorest communities in the country. Yeah. Right? And now the richest person in the world lives here. <laughs> it's a contradiction. Yes. Yeah. And it's caused this craziness around us, right? And so I love it because this is what I like. Um, and like you said, right, that in the community, it might be mixed right now. There are a lot of issues, not with Elon, but with SpaceX, yeah. right? Because we are the best place to, to come birdwatch in the whole country, right? Right, And we're launching rockets, yeah. right? So that kind of like, <laughs> yeah. that's, that could hurt. <laughs> so stuff like that, yeah. you know, that where there is some kind of potential negativeness. But overall... I found it very positive. I it's started a whole podcast yeah. called SpaceX People. You've, you've lent into it. You've yes. lent into the craziness. Yeah. And I think that that's the way you have to do it. Well, that's when you start getting stuff back, right? Yes. So like, yes. I feel like you can either, you can segment it. You don't want to see it. You don't want to speak yes. about it. You don't want to hear about it. Or you can do the opposite, which you've done. And yeah, so it start to unravel. It took me about a year to get into a room with him, right? Yeah. And, that was, and it was totally accidental. Okay. Right? It wasn't like... What you were right. trying to do, yeah, it was totally were accidental. You, were you trying, was there an element of you trying to be in a room with him up until that point, or was it just a year, you know? Now, just after, look, honestly, honestly, you've inspired some, so a bunch of people had told me, you're going to get Elon in this room, Yeah. right? And I've always been like, no, that's fucking crazy. Yeah. It's not going to happen. And then when I saw your videos last night, I was like, you know, that could be the thing, right? It's <laughs> yeah. like eventually get this guy here. Yeah, yeah. In this room, right? He's only done, I think, two podcasts from what I've seen. Right. Um, and obviously with huge stars and yeah, amazing, yeah. like, so I don't know if we could ever do that. But it, Joe Rogan. Joe Rogan. Babylon B. And then didn't he He's recently just done do no. Full Send? Yeah. yeah, Full Send. Full Send. Yeah. That's the uh, third. Which is, yeah. which is getting closer to the YouTube realm. Yes. Sort of one step closer yes. to me. Have you heard yeah. of six degrees of separation? So yeah, yeah, that's what I'm telling you that's happened to me. Yeah, you're yeah. definitely like it's hap less than that. You're it's like happening. three connections away from him, right? So right now, I work, I, I'm doing work, production work, for one of his brother's uh, foundations. Right, okay. Oh, okay. So you're, you're one connection away yes, from him. Yes, and I've already <laughs> met his brother. Yeah. Okay? Well, and not, I mean... I have been can, can you can you talk about the coffee shop? Yeah, music? yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'll tell you how this happened. It so to get you in trouble? No, no, no. I mean, I, I, haven't, I don't think I'm doing anything wrong. I'm just telling you what happened. <laughs> so, um, a friend of mine. This is how everything happens, right? I know a lot of people, and just through my craziness. Yeah. And I'm old, so that's how it happens. <laughs> and so a friend of mine calls me and says, "Hey, you know what?" Um, there's these people coming over and they're going to give away plant beds to people with dirt and veggies. So they'll have veggie gardens right. for free. Yeah. yeah. We want somebody to document it. Okay. Would you be interested in doing something like that? And I said, yeah, they'll go. Can you quote? I quote. And then, uh, we start doing it and it turns out to be his organization. It's called big green. Right. And they do this all over, but this is a pilot program where they're giving this away. Yeah, they're yeah. about to launch it in Austin and Miami. Nice. Right? And so we're making the videos that are the instructional videos on how to take care of maintain these things. Yeah, yeah. Okay? So it was awesome. And we had a really cool experience. It was awesome. And then they really liked what we did. And they were like, hey, we really like you guys. Yeah. Could you come to Atlanta next week? Because we're doing, uh, this is more like a think tank yeah. thing on what we're trying to do here. But we want to document it. And since you guys are already documenting this, could yeah. you come? So we're like, yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah. So that's where I go there. And they're forming a DAO, a blockchain type of thing to revolutionize how philanthropy works. Because this is a musk. 
Yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. And on. so now I'm in a room, and there's Kimball Musk, <laughs> and there's like a think tank table, right? <laughs> and the most, I guess, person that you might know that's in there is Beeple, the guy that sold oh, the right. largest <laughs> NFT in the world. He's sitting right there. That's, that's a wall right? room. And so then I'm documenting this, right? I'm in this I'm room. Brownsville. All of a sudden, I'm in Brownsville. The next week, this is like one week, like, no, there's no advanced planning or anything. Yeah, yeah. It's like from one week to the next, I'm with people. Yeah. Like, okay. And this <laughs> stuff happens all the time now. Yeah. And so the whole day goes through and Kimball's really nice. Um, I, I get to interview him for yeah. his thing, not for me, but like yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm talking to him and, and uh, getting the questions out. And then we go to a happy hour. And at the happy hour, he's like, everybody from Brownsville, gather, gather. Yeah, so yeah. we start gathering. And me, obviously, being like I am, right? I start talking on right away. And so he starts telling us the story that once he was at SpaceX and he wanted to listen to live music. And they told him to go to the sandwich shop, right? Which is a place you might want to go because <laughs> it'll be interesting part of the story. I'm feeling hungry. Yes. And so he's like, you go there and he goes, I walked in and this like live music was on. Yeah. This band that could have been anywhere in the world. And I just loved being down there. Yeah. And he said, what I would really love is a month from now, I'm going to be in Brownsville and I'm going to take some people that are uh, donors to the, to the cause. And um, I would like to have an event there. And I would really love, this is what he says to us. Yeah. I would really love if my brother could go because he never gets to do stuff like this. <laughs> he always, because he gets, he's paparazzi, right? Yeah, everywhere yeah, he yeah. goes. Kind of like what you were doing, right? Yeah, so he gets, he's he like. It's weird he's following him. Everywhere. Flying across the world. Everywhere. Yeah. So he's himself. like. I would like for him to have like a hang night, right? Like we just, he hangs out, yeah. just sits there and watches. So I know the owner of the sandwich shop. Right. And me being me, I'm like, I, I can make that happen. Yeah, what, yeah. what do you need? And he goes, yeah, do you think you can make that happen? It was, it's super easy to make that happen. We're in Brownsville, <laughs> right? So I'm like, yeah, I can make that happen. So I come back, I call the owner and I organize. I say, you can't say anything. And, and he, he said, don't tell him Elon's going to go because he might not go. We don't yep. know what he's doing. We don't know how crazy his life is. So mm. he might not be there that day. He might be buying Twitter. He might be. He might be. <laughs> so <laughs> then that happens. I organize it. And I just pass it to his people. And they, they figured all the logistics yeah, yeah. or whatever. But I get invited. Right? Two days before, I right. get invited. And so I'm like, cool. We're going. And then my partner, Renee, is like, hey, do you think Elon's going to be there? That morning, he announced he's going to buy Twitter. No That way. morning. <laughs> so I'm like, there's no way. Yeah, he's yeah. not even here. Right? If he's deciding to buy Twitter, yeah, yeah. he's not doing that from Brownsville. No, he's no. somewhere in LA or Austin or somewhere. So we show up and Kimball's there. And Kimball is like arranging stuff. And I'm like, why would he be moving stuff around? Right? Yeah, so he's yeah. like, we're looking at him. And then the mayor shows up, a couple of uh, city commissioners. So I'm like, they are not going to come. Yeah, unless. Yeah. So, uh, it, was, it started becoming clear and clear that he's showing up. And then Kimball comes up to me, and he's like, or to us, right? And he's like, look, remember what I told you? So if you could please, don't take your camera out. Yeah, yeah. Don't take your phone out. Yeah. And, you know, just let him be. Yeah, yeah. So, so we did, right? Um, I didn't take a picture. I, didn't, I took a picture with Kimball that night. I have a picture with Kimball and yeah, the mayor yeah. and, and, and Renee and stuff. But we let him be. But we somebody took one picture. So there's a picture out there of him that night really? in that thing. And then they, this is why I was telling you you should go. The next day they post the chair where he sat <laughs> to watch his live music. He's like, Elon sat they here. They sell it. Yeah, yeah. And it's like it's there and you could go sit. It, that's what the thing that you could do. That, you could go sit in Elon's that is chair. Wild. Yeah. That and is, so that's the That's how much night. he means to the, to the city. And that's the day he bought Twitter, dude. And so he walks in. <laughs> And he just, like, it was really cool to see this because uh, nobody went up to him. Yeah. There were SpaceX employees, a few SpaceX employees, us, this Brownsville Wellness Coalition, the one that we documented the, the planters with. Yeah. And that was it. It was a very small group. And he just walked in, he sat, and he listened to this music. And his brother would go and talk to him for a little bit. But he yeah. was, like, decompressing. Really? But He's going nuts online, right? It's yeah. he just announced he's buying it's Twitter. All up here, but yeah, he's like chill on the and we're just like look, we're just like kind of looking and like what? That's crazy. Yeah, 
And then I did one of the biggest deals in history is going on up, upstairs. And upstairs, just and, and <laughs> all over the world, people were talking about this guy that's right there. Yeah, yeah. Right, everybody's talking about him. Yeah, that that's day. nuts. Nuts. And then I did see, at the end, I'm outside and I saw how security like because well, I didn't even see how they came in. Well, that was my next question. Yeah, I was like, how does he? How does he roll? Way, way, hardcore, harder core than the Lady Gaga stuff that you had. <laughs> way. Yeah, yeah. Like he's like, got. He's got, so they close the streets. Yeah. Like kind of like what they were doing with the garage. Yeah. Right. But imagine both streets and then kind of like a tunnel. Like, so they, so they got him out. They got him in the car, like super quick. It was kind of like at the entrance of the hotel. Yeah. But there was nobody there. They made sure that nobody could get close and they just did it super quick and got him in the car and he's out. And, uh, mm. I, I think though that it becomes, it's more of an issue, like not a celebrity thing. It's kind of also starting to be national security thing. Yeah. Right. Because. What if he dies? He keeps a lot of the we're fucked. Yeah. Fuck I think we're fucked. Yeah. I think if he's gone, we're fucked. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Right. Um, I don't think we can leave this up to Zuckerberg, bro. <laughs> that's not good. That's not good. No, no. I know. I know we're running real tight today. On yeah, that. yeah. So I'm curious if you can talk to us about some of the noise or some of what's on deck for today for your mission. Yeah. Sure. This is not well, coming they, out right now anyway. Yeah, yeah. So I you, mean, I could, yeah. yeah, I'm happy to talk about it. So, uh, <laughs> well, we're going we're gonna to post some wanted posters around town. We don't, we're not expecting that to work. That's just, you know, a little introductory phase. Then we're going to ramp things up. We're hoping to get an astronaut costume and stand right outside of uh, the sort of SpaceX launch pad. Yes. Interact with employees, but we've got two huge sort of signs, mini billboards. Um, so we're going to have... Molly stood down the road saying, like, we came from London all the way to Boca Chica right. for this. And then it's me saying, hey, Elon, can I have 23 seconds of your time? That's the small ask. Like you said to us yesterday, we need a small enough ask to at least, if he's driving past or there's someone who can say, hey, there's a guy out there. Yes. Who wants. You yes. Know, he's, I, think it's, I think he did a good job with that. Elon's a meme guy, right? He's, yes. he's sort of tapped into the meme world. Like, if he knows that I'm not a weirdo and I feel like, it's putting out a lot of weirdo signs, but you know, if you, this is, so I, I'll give you another helpful hint. Yeah. I, and I don't, I don't know if this is a hint or, but I saw this on another podcast. Okay. So when he did the Tesla event. Yeah. Uh, recently, um, in Austin. Yeah. The food truck guy, there's a food truck guy called a taco palenque. Okay. And they were outside and they asked them, to wait till like one or two in the morning because they closed like at 10 or whatever. Yeah, yeah. And that he would come out and eat. So I think he eats late at night. And yeah. I think, based on what I saw at night, he probably has spots that he eats from. Okay. I don't know where. Around the... Around town. Around, okay. There, the, there's rumors, these are very big rumors, that he likes tacos. Yeah. Oh, and that, that, that particular podcast he ate Tacos. Okay. So, taco spots. Tacos. tacos yeah. Spots. And it's good I to talk about Brownsville tacos anyway. We have the best tacos. <laughs> so. I, I don't know if you could it's offer a win -win. food directly. No. But I, I wouldn't advise a direct offer, but I wonder if your sign could include an exchange of tacos somehow. Well, the, the one thing we were thinking, in the UK we have these chocolate bars called Mars bars. Yes. Yeah. No, I didn't bring any with me because yeah. that was a hindsight thought. But, um. I could get my hands on potentially like I think we sell them a little yeah. trade. You, you can, do you can sell just them. Get them at like CBS yeah. or okay. Oh, amazing! Well, because yeah. he's tweeted that he's he's never had one. I found a tweet where he said yeah, he see needs if, to see if you can offer an exchange. One. Yeah, because I, I feel <laughs> like you know, three little, seconds for a little trade would be cute. But yeah, I think so too. So we've also got you know a, a plan on top of the plan. Okay. So, like I said, we're ramping things up. It'd be good if you could give us any info potentially on, on the air. We know that he's trying to buy out a certain road or houses, or there was a community that was there that may be like yes. this place now. Um, are there anyone that's still living there? Is yes, I would say Maria would be the one. Probably Corral's told you about her, but oh, Maria, Maria Pointer. Pointer, yeah, yeah. Yeah, she's she met me. him uh, when he first, came. He's actually, she's actually talked to him when he first came. Right, okay. And I think bought her out of some of the stuff that she yeah, had yeah. out there. Um, that would be interesting. The other thing, how long are you here? Till Sunday, but we're leaving early Sunday. Yeah. Okay, I don't know 
I know you have all these plans. Yeah. But the other thing is, you know that's on the water, right? Yeah. So you get a boat, and you can go and, like, see SpaceX, like, get really close from the water. Close, right? On the other side. Closer than land? Same. The same. Same. But on the water, what are the rules there's less people. What are the rules trespass on water? I don't think there is any because, I mean, you can't get into, onto the land. Yeah, yeah, okay. But uh, I've already gone fishing by there. Yeah. And uh, I just, I think it would be a cool shot of you doing this on the water. It definitely would but, be a cool shot. But um, you can look at it logistically. But that could be another. Th- so I don't know. So when Kanye West came, Kanye West came, by the way. I just nice. wanted to throw that in there. Yeah, yeah. So when Kanye West came, there's a tower, right? And, and there's two. Have you been there yet? Uh, yeah. Okay. So you saw the two buildings mm-hmm. that are up. So in one of those, I think there's, I think that's where he offices. I think that's where he hangs. Oh, the top. So he's way up there. Oh, okay. Right? Where would you be? Yeah, Right? Yeah. So All you're way, way up there. You're looking at the ocean. Bro. It's like, yeah, it doesn't yeah. look like anything like what you're we're seeing. Fly by. Yeah. 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 Okay. yeah. Are you going to well, that, that's Yeah, what but that's, was, that's what I was going to get on to. I don't so think he likes that, though. So that could work against you. Okay. But, but we, yeah. We had, the, we had the idea, and this is like the crescendo of the plans, to hire a banner plane. Yes, I, I thought of that. Simple message. Yes. Elon, call me. My number. Yes. At the end. I it's simple. Don't know if he likes that, though. If he's bored. Yeah, yeah. He'll be <laughs> like... Because this is what... This is... A wise man told me in, um, in a cowboy outfitter's shop. <laughs> okay. <laughs> a wise man. He said, Elon is like the rest of us. How does he put on his pants in the morning? One leg, One leg at, at a time. time. Yeah. So in the same way, he's got... You know, I, I don't doubt, doubt his brain is bigger than mine. Right. But, you know, if you see a plane floating around in Boca Chica, and it's got a message on it with a little heart at the end, you might just think, fuck, I've got 30 seconds yes. to give this will, guy. Will you put the yeah. little alien, the little pixelated alien, little alien. at the end, like <laughs> the one from uh, the video game? <laughs> yeah. yeah, that, I mean, I don't, I would, I would research if that Air would space. work or not. Uh, no, because I don't think the, the main thing is if you do something he doesn't like, I know that for a fact he won't. Then. You've got to break a few eggs to make an omelet, though. Yes, the I thing, get that. Because I, I don't think I have the luxury of even trying time. to figure yeah, out whether, time. whether yeah, he'll yeah, like yeah. it or not. Yeah, I need to go guns blazing. If I annoy him to the point where he right. doesn't want to speak to me, that's what I've done. Yeah. I have to live with that for the rest of my life. Have Wouldn't you been exactly where you are now? Yeah. No communication? No, yeah, right? so, we, so you're either going to have no communication. No communication this guy. or communication. Exactly, yeah. So it's a, it's a big risk, big reward so strategy. So b- I would say, but I like that plan. I'm just telling you my thought. Yeah, but yeah. if I would do it, I would do that. Take a picture of it and tweet it. Yeah. Because I think he's more likely to see Twitter yeah, than, the sky. than he's going to see <laughs> yeah. the sky. Yeah, yeah. Right? Well, everybody, the great thing about this plan, though, is that every, and I don't want to endorse it. I just, I think it's comical. I think you are endorsing it. <laughs> no. <laughs> I think you're pushing it. You even came up with the alien pixel thing. But what, what might cause it to be successful is that it you're instigating the viral it. component. Yeah. Right? Yeah. No, that's what I'm saying. I mean, For you sure. got, you got to, that's the way that I think it could be seen. Yeah. And, and it's yes. Sa- and it's safe. The mm-hmm. only thing that I don't like about it is it's potentially distracting, right? It might cause production to slow down. Yeah. Which is which probably case, why he doesn't like it. Elon will make them work overtime. So it could be that, you know, the banner stops flying when he calls. Yeah. That would be very would expensive. Be very We've got a few yeah, that would, that would be very expensive. And that would be annoying. We're not landing until you go. <laughs> until you stop. Yeah. So, no, just like a 200 foot long banner. Um, I'd, yeah, I'd, but the, I think the tweet the tweet component is the, is, the key. Is the key. Like we're yeah. doing all this stuff on the ground, and we will meet SpaceX people. I don't think a lot of these people will be willing to talk to us. Yeah, um, I, I think that that that's the thing, though. Look, combine the astronaut sign thing yeah. on the street with the air, with the boat. Yeah, and now you're every which you're attacking them every which way. Sky on the f- ground and on the bo- on water in his. And his brain. You're his everywhere. Brain waves. You're everywhere. I'm sending the brain waves. The brain waves. Um, you got Neuralink. You got Neuralink. <laughs> Did, tell him. I, I, want, I'll be, I want to try I'll Neuralink the, now. I'll be the testing. I'll be the video. testing right now. So are you going to tell us the question? Well, the question is, it depends how it goes. Because like, if he gives me enough time, I'll ask multiple, obviously. But the crescendo of it all is going to be, Elon, if you have a spare seat, 
I would love to be the first YouTuber in space. I'd love to to stamp my foot in the history books with that. I'm a simple man. I understand. Simple, I'm not, yeah. I'm not the smartest guy on the planet. I'm not going to get to space by myself. Whereas if I can, you know, impress him enough with my 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 sort of boyish wit and charm, tenacity, the tenacity, then he might just say, "Fuck it, this would be funny to send this you, English guy to you space." You know what jumps to my head right now is so I had a guy sitting where you are right about a month ago. Yeah. Who's doing so many crazy things just to get on a ship? Like he's skydiving every single day. Really? And Man, he's sorry. and then and then and then he yeah and then he goes underwater uh, every day so that he can like <laughs> like the tanks and stuff. Like he's told me this rigorous thing that he does, and you're like, hey, I just want to see. <laughs> that, like, that, that might work. Hey, but there's no that might just, be faster. There's no justice in this. No, world, I right? get that. Yeah. I get that, but he, I just thought wants, of that. He wants to try hard. Yeah, I just thought of that. Like <laughs> this guy's the, the guy that's unprepared and brings yeah. no value to the crew. <laughs> that would that's great. a funnier story. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. No, yeah. that would that could Cause work because because really that would prove how how good the SpaceX crew, the SpaceX machinery is. If you can send a layman like me oh, to I, space, and I come back smelling a rose, I don't think, I think that it's back? a. Yeah, <laughs> I, yeah. Well. So okay, what if he said it's a one-way trip? Would you still go? Wait, yeah, wait. You you said you go to Mars. I thought you said you just go up. No, no. I, I don't think I'm prepared to go to Mars. Yeah, that's different. Yeah, I think he's just saying he'll go up and come back down. You don't think a YouTuber's gone to space yet? I don't know. I bet Bezos has sent one already. No, Bezos took uh, a so. Star Trek guy. What's his name? Uh, yeah. William Shatner. Yeah, he took I William that's Shatner. The, that's the sort of biggest entertainment. He sort of. Yeah, I think so. William Shatner's been the big now. It's okay. a trickle down effect. I do There's think. No I honestly do think you have very little time though. Oh because yeah. Because I do think somebody will go up soon. Legit, because yeah. if, if they already started doing it in a year or so, they're going to start doing it all the time. Yeah. So. Once this guy gets going, this guy moves really fast. And right now, it's been all on. It's been stalled because the FAA had stalled them for a long time. But yeah. they're about to start testing again. And once they do that, and then to just ramp up and ramp up and ramp up, and then this guy's just going to start yeah. sending people all the time. And then I'm sure Bezos and those guys are going to be like, "We got to do it too." So I want to know what he's going to say when Elon goes. What about Tim? What about Tim? Oh, everyday astronaut. Yeah, yeah. He's I'll gonna say, be like, I'll say, fuck Tim. My buddy Tim yeah. has that yeah. seat. No, well, Tim is the one that's been able to go in there and talk I'll, to. Him. I'll say, me and Tim, one v one, bare knuckle brawl in the <laughs> desert. <laughs> See who comes out on top for the seat. Smart money's on the scale. I'm not calling out. I'm not calling out Tim. I'm not calling. I think you just guy. did. You okay, yeah, maybe I did. Everyday astronaut, if you're listening, <laughs> I want your spot. Yeah, I think, yeah, I think Tim. Tim's gonna. You're gonna be tough up on that on that seat. I, I don't know whether Tim's got what it takes. Is Tim here? Tim lives in Port Isabel. I thought. Tim's yeah, like, maybe like right now though. Yeah. See, Is Tim's he here not right here now? right now. Uh, I don't know, but I, I thought that they should meet. They should try to meet Tim. Yeah, that would be smart. Yeah, definitely. We've, we've reached out to Tim. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna continue reaching out to Tim. Yeah, <laughs> see what. Well, you just you just out. challenged him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, maybe that's. I mean, you could just go to go find him, right? He lives yeah, in town. yeah. <laughs> just knock on his door. Just look for the blue Tesla. Is that what he's driving? I think we have the same car. Nice. Yeah, you don't. Yes, he does. Yeah, I'm just kidding. My so, Tesla's in the shop. So, what do you think? My best bet is today with the approach. Do you think there's a because I've 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 got my resume I've got my CV yeah my resume includes by the way I've got I bought fifty acres on Mars already so I'm essentially Elon Musk's name you're done um, about a year and a half ago I legally changed my name to X Ash Archangel Twelve Musk and I self published a a book which reached the Amazon bestsellers list okay um, it was a self help guide for his son because I went around navigating life for a month and a half called As X Ash Archangel Twelve yeah I could barely get a bank account. Everything took forever. Starbucks didn't know my name. Did you really do this? I really did that. That's awesome. Um, so I was the second person in history to be named called XS Shark Angel Twelve Mask. Um, so we've got we've got a little bit of history. Um, and I was, has any of that come out yet? Yeah, yeah, that's all that's all out in the ether. Really? Um, so yeah, we've we've got a bit of history. Me and me and Elon. He doesn't know it yet. Yeah, um, he doesn't know you got history, but you do. It's my job to. Let that's how that. that's how my life is right now. Right? Yeah. He doesn't know we have history, but we do. Yeah, yeah. He didn't meet me that day. Well, but we've already been there. Creating itself. It's, it's, you, it is. It is. Go. So yeah, with that in mind, I've got a printed out CV. So if Elon, 
isn't in town. Do, first of all, do you know if he's in town or not? Uh, one, there's there's a kid that tracks his plane, so we can find that out. Um, a kid that tracks his plane. Yeah, did you even heard about this? So there's a kid that tracks his plane. His he, he found a way to find. So because this is a license plate, yeah. right? So this kid, I don't know how he did it or what he did. He's a young kid. I don't know. He's 17, 18, 17, I think. Yeah. He figured out um, how to to know where his plane and when it's leaving and where it's going. Okay. So he posts it all the time. So that's one. Excellent. Yeah. I'm, I'm rubbing my hands together. Oh, this is a, visu, uh, a video podcast. Yes, that's well. one. Like, yeah, so you can, it's not just an audio experience, but I'm rubbing my hands together with that. Yes, info. yes. <laughs> well, yeah, we've got a video. Of this. We've got video. Smithers style. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So two is I'm pretty sure he lands in Brownsville. So his plane would be there, I would think. Okay. I don't think, I don't know how close you could get to see the plane. Right. But if, it, if they park it, right? I don't think it's parked inside anymore. I yeah, think yeah. It, it's, a, it's huge. You know, I bet if you went and visited ex- Expanding Frontiers. Maybe. Don't, don't you just look right? May, I there? don't know where. Well, because there's different places to park planes. So I don't know exactly where it would yeah. be parked. But could be. Could go in the airport maybe and look around because there's windows everywhere. Yeah, yeah. Um, because it's a very small airport. We don't have. This is a small town, right? So. You could maybe oh, yeah. go there. Okay. So that could be two. That's great. That's that's brilliant knowledge. Yeah. Second of all, yeah. I kept this one close to my chest. Corel already knows this, but um, he he warned me against it. But I'd love to get I'd love to get your insight. I've got this printed version of the resume. Okay. Do I put that in his letterbox? Do I try and figure out the place that he stays in Boca Chica? Yeah, I and go to, up to his door. I'll be honest with you. Please. Cause Cause why would I lie, right? Why would you? Why would, you, why would I lie? I, that was a stupid thing to say. <laughs> okay. Um, where he lives is probably a private road now. So I don't think you have access. Okay. I start there. Because okay. he just, they just privatized those roads. They just privatized the roads. Which means if you go in there, you'll go through this thing that I told you about where it'll probably hurt a lot for you. It'll be very hurtful. Well, that was my next question. Yeah. Because you said we'd get bounced, and you said it would hurt a lot. Is that physically, emotionally, psychologically? Yes. All of the above. All of the above. It could, yeah. Would, would well, I, would you got to think get... of you got to think of that. It's not just that. It's national security. It's 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 sensitive. Yeah. Not just because of Elon. Maybe the parallel is is if you approach like a football executive at a football stadium in the UK. Yeah. How would that go? Mm. Or, go some, some, or, or, yeah, go to, yeah, or, yeah. or go to his house, or go to or go to his house. How would that go? Parallel. Yeah, I mean yeah. the house, but the, yeah. Is there risk? Either way, is it, sounds, risk? it sounds like you want to try. I do right? want to try, like but I, f- I feel like if I'm on the plane home, and it's all gone to shit, that means it's all gone terribly. Right. Would I regret not spending the night in a cell, at the upshot of getting a piece of paper with everything Elon needs to see, through his residence? I think maybe I'd regret it, but it depends how I think it depends the severity of what will happen to me because I'm actually not. For me, it's less about the pro con, and it's more about I think you're okay. probably a smarter, more creative yeah. person. Well, wait, wait, wait. I think there's probably a better wait option. To I get I the outcome. I don't know. But, s- but think about this: smart men get desperate. If you can find, <laughs> but if you're you could desperate. find, this is what I take. If you could find, because I think we got to go. His P.O. Yeah. box was just released. Though, no, right? but Didn't if you could... tweet his P.O. box out? I don't know, but that's what I'm saying. But if you hire a courier... Oh, you're smart. Oh. Right? Oh. Yeah, he's he's, a, oh. he's <laughs> the smartest guy in the room. <laughs> Damn. Because that's legal now. And then yeah. what if you tell the courier... Attention, direct, direct, direct. Could I go with you? Oh, that's smart as shit. Dude. Mm-hmm. That's why you're in Brownsville, bro. <laughs> I'm just kidding. So Brownsville's making a smart. Elon's, dude, it's all flowing through Brownsville. We're all becoming smart. Yeah. That's, Hopefully. That's, an, that's a great shout. Because that way I don't, I don't need to have a, a cap in my ass. Yeah. Or spend the night in a cell. Yeah. Oh, yeah, and like you, don't, you, don't want, you don't want to lose respect by breaking those laws. No, no. But... That is the that's the smart way round. Okay. It? That is the smart way round. Okay. 
we gotta go yep. because Molly <laughs> is making us go. So we're on a tight sketch. This is SpaceX people. Thank you, Zach, for being here. Thanks for having me. Follow this. We're going to be showing some stuff, and I'm sure he's going to have a crazy video at the end of this. So uh, it's going to be really cool for Brownsville. It's going to be really cool uh, to watch Zach's whole experience here in Brownsville. And hopefully one day we're going to go over there. Absolutely. And talk to you over there. If you're, yeah, if you're in London, give me a yeah. shout. And if things get really crazy and you want to come back and yeah. talk about this craziness while you're here, we'll do it again. We could do it at night. I yeah. mean, this is... Hey, do it at midnight. Brown, you can do it all Brownsville's the time. now my second home. Hey, so if, if shit gets you know, crazy with the video, I'll be here in a minute. That's happening a lot, Zach. Yeah. That's what this crazy dude did. <laughs> right? He used to live in New York. Yeah. Yeah. So London. Nothing. Yeah. Thank yeah. you for being here. Thank, Thank you, guys. guys. Appreciate it. Thanks, Zach. Amazing.